evidence of substantial storm surge. Looks like at least 10 feet here, and this is just to the north of a floodgate that protects southern Cockadry off to the south down near the research center as well. This is way out uh, into the Gulf of Mexico, basically here. We have water on either side, and interestingly, the storm surge came from west to east as the westerlies in the southern eyewall uh, uh, resided here for a very long time when Hurricane Ida stalled out just to the east of the Homa, Louisiana area, and that uh, sent big time westerlies that piled up this water just to the north of the floodgate. And interestingly, to the south of that floodgate, hardly any evidence of storm surge. So this actual floodgate that is des designed uh, to protect from encroachment of a storm surge with southeasterly winds or easterly or southerly winds actually did the opposite and helped to pile up this water uh, from Cockadry off to the north, anywhere to the north of the floodgate, all the way to the Chauvin area. Uh, also uh, had quite a bit of storm surge damage and there is a debris line as well on the other side of this canal right along that levee and that says these westerly winds were piling up the water double digit storm surge for sure we've seen water lines as well on many of the stilts on these homes and some of these bigger buildings uh, but definitely a, a storm surge that is simply not survivable down here deep in the bayous of louisiana for powerful category four hurricane ida yesterday evening